and welcome back. Still having a conversation with the uh, Governor Colonel Rosanga. Governor, you, you're, you're talking so well about health system in Seya County. But the challenge that usually uh, most, people, most counties faced is the strike by the doctors, the health personnel. What did you talk about that? Yeah, that has been a, a very big problem mm. uh, to us, but we have managed it somehow. Yes. So that uh, dealing with uh, them has not been very easy. Mm. But we have always tried to tell them that, look here, help was devolved because of you. Yes. Right? Uh, the fact that payment has delayed, mm. that should not make you go on strike. Mm -hmm. Simply because, after all, it is delayed. You know the reason why it is delayed. But it will come and it will be paid. Do you communicate to them? Yes, we do. We do. And, uh, and, and sometimes we agree. Yes. Sometimes we don't agree. Uh -huh. Yeah. But in most cases, we have agreed. So that the effect of striking, say, if I have to say it, mm. it has been very minimal. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And again, one thing that we resorted to mm. is that we employ the workers. Now, when we employ them, we employ mm. them on contract. Mm. Yes. Mm. So the ones on contract will never go on strike. Yes. Yeah. What about promotions? Promotions we do. We have done that as required by law. Because most, most doctors who say that they stay in particular positions for far too long. We address that. We address that largely sometimes some two, three years ago. Mm -hmm. yeah, and that is no longer a problem. Yes. The biggest problem to date in, uh, in, uh, with the, the nurses and uh, doctors mm. is normally just, there are small things that yeah. the salary has delayed uh, because, of course, they are also supposed to be paying other agencies mm -hmm. when it is delayed then you know that affects their position yes but it's normally temporary mm. yeah let's talk about the issue of corruption because the president was so uh, passionate about the fight against corruption and most governors still have pending cases in court because of corruption misappropriation of public money this is one of the reasons why most counties delayed in terms of service delivery, right? I don't agree with that. Mm -hmm. Delay in service delivery is not because of corruption. Largely, it could be created by many things, mm -hmm. including corruption at the other end. Yes. Yeah? But the, the, the issue is true mm -hmm. that the elements of corruption are there. Yes within the county. What would you make about CI in particular? There are cases of corruption, I can tell you. Mm. Because uh, we have been having the anti-corruption on and off, mm. uh, doing investigations here and there. Mm -hmm. We have had some convictions. Yes. Two or three convictions. Mm -hmm. And that shows you that corruption is there. Mm -hmm. However, we have been really trying to contain it, mm. yeah? Mm -hmm. But the biggest problem is the mindset of Monage. Yes. And the current generation of people who work smart, mm. yeah? Mm -hmm. uh, the, current, the current youthful people do not wait and, and see yes. that you can work, save, Mm. and out of your savings you can invest mm -hmm. and from that you can easily uh, buy a car mm -hmm. or do whatever it is mm -hmm. with the money mm -hmm. they want it very fast they call it instant coffee you just put sugar coffee and you have your tea it's unfortunate that is what we have in CI I believe other counties may also be experiencing the same problem mm -hmm. but the biggest solution that would be on that yes would be somebody should some careful study should be taken mm. yeah allow me to allow me to ask you this question because you are an outgoing governor the issue of pending bills is affecting most counties what is the situation i think say we are safe we you, really, you can't say that you're safe you are safe because we have dealt with many mo most of the pending bills we have dealt with many 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 pending bills yes and um even if it is there, mm -hmm. they are, we are managing them because we, have, we had sent a program mm -hmm. to the COB. Yes. 
so that we go by the schedule mm. that each time we are given the money there is some money that we go we spend on on pending bills yes yeah what is the current status of CIA? CIA they are telling me that it is less than 24 million which i don't agree it could be something like 200 million 200 mm. 20 million that's a lot because you have uh just five months to exit office yes i i am not very sure mm. according to what they told me this morning yes they told me that this is 24 million 24 million yeah you know most 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 of the governors people who will be coming in uh next to jim they'll be inheriting these spending bills are you intending to complete them to pay the suppliers you know all the pending bills to be clear before you exit? No, our government will continue the government will be continuing it's only the government the governor that will be going out yes but the rest of the remain. staff will be there governor and the deputy mm -hmm. but the governor and deputy comes in isn't it mm. the ministers will go but the chief officers will remain will remain so that government should be able to manage those debts mm. as it were mm. so that even the program of paying them should not be restricted yes to the end of the the financial year mm. yeah but some, some would argue that some governors are taking advantage they're saying that you know ah, we are going out so the next governor will take over uh, that will be very unprofessional you know we have to run these offices professionally right so that um uh what you are leaving behind mm. you must you must leave a name mm. yes you must leave a name you know it is important to have a name having a name is very 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 important yes yeah uh, m most most actually most governors including sierra county you had not so good kind of relationship with the with the treasury in terms of disbursement of the of the money to the counties not sierra sierra has been doing very well but disbursement to the counties has not been good you, you can't say that she has been doing well governor because wh what is what is your county uh, revenue collection revenue collection you know that is what brings in the pending bills yes pending bills come because of lack of collection of revenue but we have really managed to mm. to bridge the gap mm -hmm. so that as we are speaking uh, I formed a task force mm. which is currently even on on it for the last financial year mm -hmm. and this financial year mm -hmm. they are really trying to make sure that the the the, we, the 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 revenue is collected yes as per the target so so that even if uh, you don't reach it yeah but the gap remains very small what is the an average of CIA annually so to speak or quarter as a result of the task force yes i'm seeing that uh, the the difference came to be very minimal right very very minimal how much are you given by the national government treasury uh, the revenue allocation we normally get about seven billion every financial year yes well, on the average yes so our budget is about between seven and eight billion mm. yeah that's that's not bad for CIA. well we are not complaining much mm -hmm. but it is bad in the sense that the money that we get yes does not give us the services that we want to give to the people mm. yeah for example i have just received some message this morning mm. we had a supplementary budget and uh, the amount that is allocated yes to help for uh, food your uh, patients uh -huh. is not enough <laughs> <laughs> you get it <laughs> um, um, you remember the mochery the mochery business in uh, yes in Yala. yes now to manage that mochery something that you complained about yes does that worry you as a governor because you said that the moshe which is there cannot is not enough to it have. is it is because if you cannot you know when you are elected by the people mm. you are elected by the people so that when they they have lost a loved one mm. they give that loved one the respect that the the loved one deserves yes until they send the person off mm. isn't it mm -hmm. but now when other bodies are brought there yes. that you had not imagined truly uh, uh, brings a lot of problems yes yeah governor rivayala is in sierra county 
And Rivayala has uh, in, in We also in, have Rivanzo here. Yeah. Rivanzo. So why not Rivanzo here? Yeah. <laughs> no, 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 no. Because of the obvious reasons, <laughs> Rivayala in, in, in a few weeks ago um, in, did not have some good, you know, story in, in the news. What would you make of that? Uh, are you, you are the governor, you are the CEO of that county. Yeah, it's and really I came delicious. out very clearly and addressed the national government. Where are these bodies coming from? They were dropped there. But the thing is this. Uh, the national government took very f fast, drastic steps mm. to, to do uh, a forensic investigation. Yes. So that uh, they took the samples and came with them to mm. Nairobi here and so on and so forth. Mm. And I was thinking that the best the government could have done yes. was to take those bodies to, to City Mocha. Mm. Then they do the rest of the things there instead of leaving the bodies there at CI. Preliminary investigations, what are the, the indications? Where were these bodies coming from? No, no, no. We never, there was nobody who ever reported a loved one lost. Within Sierra County. Within Sierra County. And that means that they must have come from outside. With the waters, because you see, when the waters arrive, there is no visa for water. When it's, it's arriving in Sierra. <laughs> <laughs> Is it? According to the eyewitnesses, they say that some 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 vehicles would come with, um, you know, at night bodies stashed in in gunny bags or in gunias that dumped, and then they go. I, I can't tell. I can't tell about that. Yes, I can't tell. But it was it was a very it's a very bad thing. Why? Mm -hmm. Because public health we use those that water exactly for our domestic uses. Yes, isn't it? Mm -hmm. So whoever is even doing that. It doesn't, it's, it's not good, a good thing at all. Mm. It's very uncivilized. Yes. Yeah. So you can assure the residents and general public that you, you are on, in control of that? I'm not in control because the, once I complained to the national right. government, they came, never came back to me. Because the, the only decent thing they could have done not yet, was eh? to transfer those bodies. Okay, my name is George Either Lomba. to Nunez, a general hospital. you can hear me. Because then they have a bigger capacity. Mm -hmm for dead bodies yes or to city mutuary because city mutuary is for the national government yes isn't it yes yeah if elections are be held today who would you vote for for Aila. without without opening my eyes i would vote for Aila. and governor of CIA, who do you vote for to succeed you that one i can't i can't tell now because there are people who are competing mm. for it and it would not be fair for me to start talking about people to, to, to vote for. I'm asking that because Sierra politics is one of the hardest and the toughest. The competition in Sierra is on another level. You, you, you faced it. You faced it. And three it, times. Three times. Yes. What is so unique about Sierra? Sierra is uh, where we have people who are very enlightened. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> Okay. Yeah. The voters are very enlightened. So picking a candidate is always a challenge. Yes. And CIA, by the way, is where people also uh, talk about justice. Justice. Mm -hmm. That justice must be seen to be done. That is your county. It's your county. They are particularly, you know, you know, even the Sierra that are in the diaspora. Yes. Wherever they are, they are also very active. And they are the ones that make the ground to be more active. Mm -hmm. Yes. So, Today, so, I don't know, maybe you can get some data from, from Safaricom mm -hmm. on the kind of calls that are made during this season. Mm -hmm and uh, whether they are politically related. You will find they are politi just mm. politics. Mm. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. Interesting. Um, I'm, I'm asking that question because um, the president said that uh, people should support Honorable Raila Odinga. And uh, he went to Sagana, talked to Mount Kenya people, and they all agreed that, uh, yes, he will support Raila Odinga. Some people are saying that the president should take a neutral ground. But the president said that he's also a voter. No, as far as I'm concerned, uh, one, I have told you I cannot take sides right now. Right. 
But after the nomination, mm. definitely you will see me supporting who, who has been nominated by the party. Mm. Right? Yes. President Kenyatta has his right to lead this country, mm. right, mm -hmm. to better leadership. One, he has measured himself mm -hmm. and he has seen what kind of leadership is required. Right? Yes. He could probably have measured to it mm -hmm. and he doesn't want it to come down. Right? Yes. Or he could have not measured to it. Mm -hmm. So he wants Raila to be the one to bring it from wherever it yes. is to bring it up, to make the graph grow. Yes. Okay. Out, out of a out of, uh, hundred, how would you rate your administration ten years later? Out of hundred? Yes. We are operating at around 70%. You are too generous. That is what I'm giving. So you can give me what you think <laughs> I deserve. <laughs> you are too generous. 70%. What attributes to 70%? Quite a lot of things. Mm -hmm. See, I've told you I was I was taking you through health. Yes. I never went to water. I've mm -hmm. told you water. Or we all, almost have sixty percent coverage mm. of house households with water. Mm. In CI, we have not reach, reached the 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 threshold as it, it were. Yes. Uh, I've talked about roads. That roads are almost everywhere. Mm -hmm. That one is almost at one hundred percent. Yes. Right. Mm -hmm. um, when it comes to to trade, mm. to trade, eh? yeah, we have also tried as much as we can to, to build markets mm. so that the traders would find it easy and comfortable to mm. sell their wares. Yeah, mm -hmm. uh, you know, a long time ago, whenever you go to a market, mm. you would not even find a place where to help yourself. Right. But now we have tried to sort out that mm. slowly by slowly. I believe in another ten years, yes, we shall have another mark. Mm. Yeah. Okay, as we come to a close, Governor. Um, when you talk of your office, it, sometimes ago it, on social media, people said that uh, uh, Governor Asanga built state house in CI in the name of office. That you are becoming too low <laughs> for a governor. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> no, it is just an office that befits a governor. Uh, whoever governor that will come to it, it is a nice office. It's beautiful. It's yeah. beautiful. It's a beautiful office. It's beautiful. Yeah. Um, uh, finally, the issue of nomination. You are yes, the out. issue of nomination. You see, nomination is a party thing. Mm. And the way the party is supposed to organize for uh, the nominations, is 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 that the who has got who is who has been supporting the party for yes. example the loyals loyals those are supposed to be even be given direct nomination if somebody is loyal yes isn't it yes and is 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 a professional for example mm -hmm. why should that person compete with somebody who only has the money but that's what happens, Governor. Yeah, that is, yeah, that is what going I'm, to I'm, change I'm hands. expressing. I'm expressing my myself. Yes, as you have asked me. So as for for, for me, the party is supposed to give direct nomination mm. to the people who have been loyal to the party, and the people who have been assisting the party mm. with the finances or otherwise. Mm. They should be given the first priority. Should be given the first priority. Mm. For nomination, yes. But however, you must know that democracy. Re, uh, there are some people, especially now, mm. direct nomination. There will be a, a big number of people there out there who would not wish it mm. to be there, mm -hmm. isn't it? There yes. could even be thirty percent. Seventy percent would be for me. Thirty percent would not be for mm -hmm. you. But that is democracy. So that seventy should be taking swing. Mm. You get it? Yes. So the party should be in a position to interrogate mm -hmm. and do it in such a way that, yes, there is an objective criteria that it uses mm. in selecting people to be given direct nomination. 
That is number one. All right? And number two, I support them, I support the party in the approach for consensus. Mm. So that, yes, you could be conducting poll opinion mm -hmm. here and there. Yes. And then you bring these people on the table. The favorite. Yes, and ask them, this is what you are currently getting. Yes. Would you wish to continue? Or you say bye to this thing mm. and so that we consider people who are likely to get the thing. Yes. That is a good thing because it is now narrow narrowing down the candidates who are, who are serious. Mm. Right? Yes. And so be it. And then finally, the, what I know the ODM is going to do, mm -hmm. I don't know whether it's going to be Azimio. <laughs> <laughs> what ODM is going to do <laughs> is that when all these others have not been used, yes. then what remains is that elections will be done with the parties that have not mm. sorted out themselves. Yes. So that the universal suffrage mm -hmm. is used especially from amongst the members mm -hmm. of the party mm. who shall have been registered yes. with the party headquarters. Although mm -hmm. the capacity mm -hmm. to also manage that leaves a lot to be desired. It's a problem because nomination is always it's no, but yes, but you see, the moment you have started with direct nomination, as I have said, mm. and you use a, a proper objective criteria in, 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 in zeroing in on those people that you are going to give direct yes. nomination, then you lessen problems at this goes. Although it is also possible mm. that you can give somebody direct nomination and somebody who is independent <coughs> will, will, mm. will, will, will defeat him, right. isn't it? Yes. But that is democracy. That is democracy. Yeah. Okay. Governor, we are coming to a close. Um, two questions. Um, what next for Governor Rasanga after 9th of August? What next for me? Are you going for a member of parliament seat, senate seat? No, no, no. <laughs> I, I was being asked by the, uh, the, the uh, Allego mm -hmm. electorate that I go for the uh, seat, the MP seat. Mm -hmm. But I have since considered it and discussed it with the party leader, mm -hmm. discussed it with the other friends of mine. Mm. And I am concentrating on the elections of the president. All right. Uh, so I am the one who is coordinating elections for, for Nyanza. Mm. Right? Mm -hmm. And very soon, I will be going to the ground mm -hmm. so that we select a secretariat mm -hmm. for it mm -hmm. and have people yes. who will be coordinating the grounds mm. as it were yes uh, maybe next week or, or something like that mm. yeah so you're not running for any political office i'm not running for any political office i, I want to make sure that baba mm -hmm. becomes the fifth president of this country and you know in baba's house there are so many houses there are so many rooms and there are so many rooms so if I will be given a room there, I know what you mean. I, 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 I will be very comfortable. <laughs> Finally, I'm in, I want to enroll for my PhD. Oh, you want to be a doctor? Yes, I want to do that from September. Mm -hmm. Once I'm out of the office, mm -hmm. I want to be in class. I'm out of the office in August, class, class in September. That's a challenge. Yeah, that's a challenge. Mm -hmm. That's a challenge. We wish you all the best. Yeah. Thank you so much. Okay. We'll be speaking to Governor Colonel Rasanga, who says that there is an airport, not an airstrip, an airport <laughs> in Zia <Zier laughs> County. Um, we've talked a myriad of issues in terms of health, education, challenges that are faced as governors, the pioneers of the, uh, the, the current constitution, and so far he's going out. We thank you for keeping it KBC Channel 1. We're taking a break. We'll be right back.